how sleep changes as we age and what we can do about it. Have you ever wondered why babies sleep so much? Why teenagers struggle to wake up in the morning? Or why older adults seem to wake up at dawn without an alarm? Sleep isn't one size fits all experience. It changes dramatically throughout life. But here's the big question. Are we adapting to those changes the right way? Today we'll uncover the surprising truth about sleep at every stage of life and how small changes can lead to better, more restorative rest. Welcome, I'm Dick Bain of Devon Device. If you care about our planet and aspire to live more sustainably while also seeking the secrets to a truly great night's sleep, this is the channel for you. Before we explore this, here's a question for you. Have you ever had a sleep habit that changed as you got older? Maybe you used to be a night owl but now crash early. Let me know in the comments. Let's get into it. The five major sleep stages, what happens at each and how can you optimize your rest for every phase of life. So this is the sleep journey from infancy to older age. Most of us are doing sleep all wrong. At infancy it is sleeping like a baby or not. Newborns sleep anywhere from 14 to 17 hours a day. But here's the catch. It's completely unpredictable. Their circadian rhythm hasn't developed yet, so they don't know day from night. That's why parents experience those chaotic nights. But here's what's fascinating. Babies spend more than half of their sleep in REM, REM, the stage linked to brain growth and memory formation. This means sleep isn't just about rest, it's about building the foundation for a lifetime of learning. Ever noticed how some babies sleep like logs while others wake up constantly? A lot of it has to do with their sleep cycles. But external factors like noise, temperature and even what they sleep on can make a huge difference. So this, the tips I can give you, use breathable natural products. Babies can't regulate their body temperature well. Keep the room dim and quiet at night, but expose them to daylight during naps to help their uh, circadian rhythm develop faster. In the childhood phase, it is the golden age of sleep, if you get it right. Between the ages 3 and 12, children typically need 9 to 12 hours of sleep per night. Their deep sleep stages are longer than adults, which is why kids can fall asleep anywhere, on the floor, in the car, mid-sentence, you name it. But here's the problem. Screens, school pressures and the late night excitements can start chipping away at their sleep quality. Kids who don't get enough sleep may struggle with focus, mood swings and even weaker immune systems. Did you know, study shows that just 30 minutes less sleep per night can affect a childhood's ability to concentrate in school. So what, what can help is create a calming bedtime routine, reading, music or a bath to train the brain to expect sleep. Ditch the screens at least an hour before bed. Blue light tricks the brain into thinking it's still daytime. When children become adolescents, the question is why teens are basically jet lagged. Teenagers are often labeled as lazy for wanting to sleep in, but science says otherwise. Their internal clock shifts, making it harder to fall asleep early and harder to wake up in the morning. Nationwidechildrens.org you can find a lot of information about this stage of life. The problem is, school starts way too early for their biological rhythms, leading to chronic sleep deprivation. This affects everything from academic performance to emotional regulation. If you are a teen or a parent of one, this might sound familiar. You are wide awake at midnight, but completely useless at 7 a.m. That's not a bad habit, it's biology. So, what you can do is keep a consistent sleep schedule, even on weekends. Messing with your routine makes Mondays even harder. Block out early morning light to allow deeper sleep when teens need it most. School should start later to fit teenage sleep cycles. Let's hear your thoughts in the comments below about this. At adulthood, it is the battle of a good night's sleep. By adulthood, most people need 7 to 9 hours of sleep. But let's be honest, who's actually getting that? Work, stress, caffeine, late night scrolling, all of these chip away at deep quality sleep. The problem is, we don't notice the impact immediately. 
but the long term poor sleep leads to weaker immune system, weight gain and even increased risk of heart disease. Think about it, when was the last time you woke up feeling genuinely refreshed? So what is important? To stick to a regular bedtime. Sleep isn't just about duration, consistency matters too. Use natural bedding. Synthetic materials can trap heat and chemicals, interfering with deep sleep. At an older age, why does sleep feel different? Many older adults wake up early, sleep lighter and even nap more. This is because melatonin production declines, making it harder to stay asleep. On top of that, conditions like arthritis, restless legs or even certain medication can disrupt sleep. But here's what's surprising. Older adults still need 7 to 8 hours of sleep. It just happens differently. Ever heard uh, someone say, I don't need as much sleep now that I'm older. That's a myth. The need for sleep doesn't decrease, only the way it is structured. So what can you do to get the 7 to 8 hours sleep? Make the room darker and quieter. Melatonin is extra sensitive to light in later years. Choose breathable wool bedding to regulate body temperature, especially for those experiencing temperature fluctuations. So how to sleep better at any age? Here's the deal. No matter your age, these three rules will improve your sleep. Create a sleep friendly environment, cool, dark and quiet. Choose natural breathable bedding. Your sleep environment affects your quality of rest more than you realize. Stick to a routine. Your body loves consistency. So did any of these sleep facts surprise you? Which stage are you at? And what is your biggest sleep struggle? Drop a comment below. I would love to hear your thoughts. At Devon Dubais, we believe great sleep starts with natural handcrafted bedding designed to support your rest at any age. Want better sleep? Subscribe for more insight on sleep, sustainability and well-being. Check out devonduvais.com for premium wool bedding designed to improve your rest. I'm Dick Bain of Devon Duvais and until next time, sleep well, live better. Mm -hmm.